There's Luke and his little brother Lake. Morgan spends more time with Aunt Sydney than his birth mother Baldy. Wesley dwells on the fringes of Skullhead's troop, but enjoys an elevated status during mating season. He becomes the center of attention as the females vie for his affection. The mating season brings out fierce rivalries among the females. Even to the point where a lower ranking individual like Vanessa is willing to take on a highborn like Sarah in the battle for Wesley's affection. Sensing that she had gained the upper hand, Vanessa demanded that Sarah cease her advances and leave Wesley alone. Picking up on Sarah's encroaching presence around Wesley, Vanessa swiftly moved forward. (laughs) 
How the tables have turned, Wesley signals that he embraces Sarah's offer as well. Although there is no penetration involved here. Wesley, are you trying to incite some drama here? You can immediately see the difference in Sarah's attitude. Despite her higher ranking, she was slow to reprimand Vanessa's previous provocation, because Vanessa had Wesley's backing. But with the clear indication Vanessa doesn't have Wesley's unequivocal support, Sarah wasted no time in reasserting her dominance. <laughs> These buff males from Dopus Boy Band are perhaps flattered by Sarah's attention. Tonya has mom's undivided attention, at least for now. Look away now, Woody. This is no place for curious eyes. <laughs> Looks like Wilde is pursuing Olivia. It seems they've made it clear that they'd like some time to themselves right now. As the weaning process takes its toll, poor Aurora frantically calls for mum. Avon steps in to care for her little sister.
Sophia's resolve ultimately softened when confronted with Aurora's persistent pleas, and she acquiesced to her daughter's needs. Everyone's on the move. It seems they have caught wind of something promising, perhaps a meal's on wheels. The clan is a dynamic patchwork of close-knit families, each a unique and integral part of the greater whole. Ginny's journey throughout adulthood hasn't diminished her need for the soothing familiarity of mum's embrace. Giselle brushed aside mum's attempts at grooming, as her uncompromising focus remained locked on the milk bar. <laughs> 